Speak to them in parables. I'll speak to you in parables. Because people don't seem to understand just the regular simple words. But I think you'll understand this, okay? There is a cliff. You're standing on the edge of the cliff and the ground beneath your feet gives way. And you start falling immediately. There's nothing to grab onto. You're doomed. You're gonna fall and die. But then a person, I'll tell you who the person is later, but a person comes and reaches out their hand just in the nick of time and grabs onto your hand and you grab onto their hand and they pull you up and now you're not going to die. Now you were saved. Okay? The cliff is the globe. The person is Jesus and his hand is flat earth. That's the time we live in right now. Someone's reaching out their hand as you're falling right now. You're falling. And they've reached out their hand. This person has reached out his hand. Grab on to the only chance that you have from falling. The only chance that you have is this person's hand. Grab on to their hand. The person is Jesus. His hand is flat earth. It's by his grace that we are saved. And that's the best I can do. A lot of people are saying things like, His hand can't save you. Only he can save you. So he's reaching out his hand. They've grabbed onto his hand. And he lifted them back up. And they're telling the other people falling that his hand can't save you. Only he can. And these other people are like, What are you talking about? His hand is part of him. His hand is what he's reaching out. He's using his hand to save you. That's my parable. That's, a, that's the best I can do. People will continue to call this idea heresy when I say that flat earth can save you. They don't understand what I mean. And these people admit openly that Flat Earth brought them to Jesus. I hope you understand what I'm saying. Have a good one.